That's right, Corey. And the victim has been here at Lincoln Hospital in a coma for about three months, and her condition has not changed since this incident. Take a look behind me. Police put flyers up with the man's picture on it. Also, the Crime Stoppers van is right there so people can know exactly who they're looking for. They need better security. A single voice speaking up outside Lincoln Hospital after a brazen sex assault on a patient who's in a coma. Police say this man you see on surveillance video from inside the hospital took an elevator to an upper floor, entered the room of the unconscious woman. He then allegedly touched and kissed the 68 year old until another patient in the room called out to a nurse for help. That's sad. That's very sad. As far as security in the hospital goes. We need better security for our patients because anyone could come in without authorization. Oswald Dennis came to visit his mother in the hospital and after hearing what happened. I feel for my mother. I feel not only just for my mother, but for every other citizen here in the South Bronx. Lincoln Hospital does have a security checkpoint for visitors to show ID at the main entrance on the first floor. But former NYPD Lieutenant Dr. Darren Porcher tells PIX11 that's about it. Normally you have unarmed officers um, that are employed by the Health and Hospitals Corporation and they generally conduct security on the first level. The question now is what about the other floors and other entrances? You go around which is the emergency entrance, and you can sneak in at anywhere. How this man got into the hospital is something police are looking into, whether or not he was a visitor here or if he knows the victim. This is really a harbinger for ramping up security and fortifications in all city hospitals, not just Lincoln Hospital. And in a statement, a spokesperson for Lincoln Hospital said the safety of staff and patients is their number one priority, and they are working with police on this. If you have any information on the man we're talking about from the video there, we'll call Crime Stoppers. The number is 800 577